Where'd the rock come from? It's the media that Reed bought from a farmer. It had fallen in his field. Are you picking up any sound, Ben? There's a crackling sound, like radioactive material. I haven't been able to penetrate this meteoric material with my most sensitive devices. Maybe I can burn a hole in it. Flame on! Concentrate it more. Don't destroy the structure. I can't even phase it. That's cold. What do you want to do? Blast this out of here? Let me try it. Oh, it's still hot. That might make it brittle enough to knock a hunk off. Ow! That about busted my little pinch. But I got it, Chuck. This is remarkable. There is some sort of nuclear core in this meteor, yet it showed negative on the Geiger counter. I think I'll test it on the radium stabilizer. We'll project the test on the big screen. I'm all set. Here we go. That material has the strangest molecular structure I've ever seen. Changing. Yes, yeah, it's absorbing the radium from the stabilizer. Quick, turn it off. This thing looks dangerous. It will need a lot more study. Right, Sue. Ben, will you put the big meteor in the lead vault? Okay, Skipper. It'll take just a sec. Hey, Johnny, what's going on outside? I don't know. It sounds like a riot. Wow, come look at this. Some kind of glow floating over the cloud. Come on, let's get down there fast. the building behind you. It's gone. Incredible. I can't believe it. Look above you. Hey. It's exploding in the sky. This man, whoever he is, has the most amazing powers I've ever seen. Now, behold the building returned to its foundation. That is an example of my power. So listen well to what I have to say. I hereby nullify every man-made law. There will be none to give orders except me, the molecule man. I will be the law. Not while we live. Who dare? Who dares question the molecule man? We dare. We who are known as the Fantastic Four. Who are you? Since it will not affect my plans for all of you, I will tell you who I am and also of the source of my tremendous power. A few years ago, I was just a laboratory technician working for Acme Atomic Corporation. I did all the work, and they made all the money. And I dreamt of bigger and better things for myself. But no man can work with atomic devices while his mind toys with other things. a trillion to one accident. The terrific atomic forces had done something to me. I knew a molecular change had taken place. A tingling of power. Because of the accident, I have acquired the power to rearrange all molecules, to control everything, to be all powerful. All mankind shall obey my every command. Not all mankind will obey. Not the Fantastic Four. You fools! Do you think yourself capable of crossing swords with me? That street light! I'll rearrange the molecules. Now behold, a giant aircraft engine in reverse speed. I didn't get my force field set fast enough. The wind has caught wings. I create magic from dust particles. He can create them. And I can clop. Then wreck the wind machine. I'll go help Reed. Play him on! Ha! 
much confusion. <laughs> <laughs> I must leave you for now. I have a meeting with your military leaders. <laughs> My next encounter will be different. We have to find a flaw in his amazing power. You know, gang, our answer to the molecule man may be in electricity. No one has ever caught it or stopped it long enough to study it. I get it. You don't think the molecule man can alter the molecule in electricity. Right, too. And I have an idea for a weapon that he won't be able to stop. Well, let's get to work on it right now. Extra, extra, molecule man to speak to Chief Sister. Extra, extra. I am sure you are all aware of the changes I have caused in all of your military equipment. All of your tanks and armor are now sawdust. Your aircraft are no more. Your ammunition powder, order. I have rearranged all the molecular structure. Why is this meeting called and what is your plan? I call this meeting to inform you that I am now your supreme commander, and you shall do as I say. No, 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 no. I shall be ruler of the world. You think this will do the trick? Yes, Ben. With this gun, I believe that we can meet the molecule man on equal ground. I don't quite get it. Then how do we use the gun? Quite simple. It's a defense weapon. You shoot the object that you think he's going to change, coating it with a microelectrode power. Since he can't rearrange electronic molecules, this defeats his effort. I get it, Reed. Instead of bullets, the gun shoots dust. The molecule man is terrorizing the entire country. How do we start to defeat him? We start now. And so this city is under explicit orders from the molecule man. Any citizen knowing the whereabouts of the Fantastic Four must report this information to the Molecule Man. Careful now. He's on the steps of the library. Sue, you become invisible and get close to him. Johnny, get as close as you can, but try to stay hidden. Be ready to flame on when I signal. Okay, go. You and I will bring up the rear. It's clobbering time. Let's go. If you don't deliver the fantastic war to me by tomorrow, I will destroy the city, and in the meantime, I'll put a glass cage over the entire area. And as a further reminder of my powers, observe the statue on my left. I release you, Simba! All this molecule, man, it's clobbering time! Do not want it in the crowd. You, kidding? So oh, at last, the Fantastic Four are here. See how fast you can clobber the other lion statue. Now we'll test the weapon. I release you. What? What? Could it be? Can I be losing my powers? The lion didn't come to life. The effect hurts my arm. It worked. Now to get set up for Johnny. You realize that your powers are not as you thought they were. Surrender. Never. Not while I can change the molecules of dust in the atmosphere. I'll let him get away, Johnny. Okay, Reed. Faster than I can burn it. Give me more. 
What are the invisible woman's powers? What are the invisible woman's powers? She can make things invisible and create force fields. Quick, Sue. See if you can throw your force field in front of it. I think I can. Good work, Sue. Can you hold him? I can't. He's dissolved his capsule. He's getting away. Don't worry, Sue. When he gets down, I'll club. They think a simple force field can hold me. Ah! He's falling. Don't be too sure. <laughs> From the particles, I, the molecular man, can form any piece of equipment I need. <laughs> <laughs> that trick with the statue of the lion. I must find out what it is and how it works. And that pain in my arm. I don't know what it could be. I'll find out, and then the final round. We've located a tank the Molecule Man hasn't rearranged. I intend to get that information to the Fantastic Four immediately. Now, I've increased the range of our powder electrode gun to two miles. This should be of great help. Headquarters, Fantastic Four. Yes, General? Yes, sir. Yes, General. Thank you, sir. We'll check it out. Goodbye. This is the opening we've been waiting for. Let's go. There's the tank. And Mr. Molecule Man aims his wand at this stuff. He'll be in for a big surprise. Start shooting, Ben. Just as good, Ben. Shoot all the rest of that equipment while we rig the tank. Okay. Johnny, you jump inside and torch that cannon out of the turret. Quicker and a wink. We'll put our powder electrode gun in the turret and get close enough to give them a bad time. Hey, the cannon is cut loose. Here it comes. That does it. Everyone get aboard and we'll see if we can find Mr. Molecule Man. Stop here. I'm going to stretch up and see if I can spot him. Ah, ah there he is in the square again, haranguing the people. Thus far, I disregarded your disobedience, but soon the fantastic force will be no more. And then... Ah. So, head for the square and get ready for a fight. You will be regimented into workforces to start my campaign for world conquest. You will... What's that? The tank looker. Aha! The enemy approaches. See how easily I stop them. I'll change the molecules of cement. And race the street to stop them. Okay, Johnny, start cutting. Fragment. Hurry! Okay! Be back in a flash! Why 
the fragment. Just came to me. I think it's the real answer. Try to use them, the feedback hurts your arm. I don't believe it. Hold up the weapon. Here it is. Careful, Reed. Don't trust him. Aha! Disintegrate! Disintegrate! Like I said, you're through. No! No! I'm not beaten. I'll go back to my nuclear globe and think. Here, Reed, here's the meteor fragment. What's going on? Tell you later. It's still glowing. I can just keep this thing focused on the glow. Like I thought. The atomic globe is reacting. Oh, look how it's shrinking. Now it's changing shape. He's the lab technician who was injured in the atomic explosion. What happened? Why am I not in my lab? Why am I out here in the streets? We take over now, thanks to the Fantastic Four. How did you ever figure out that the meteor fragment was a secret? We knew that the molecule man was hit by an atomic explosion and was full of radiation. I hoped the meteor fragment would absorb his molecular powers. And it did. Just think. That's all that's left of the powers that was going to conquer the Earth. Yes. Well, it looks like the power is gone from the molecule, man. Yes, but he knows how he got it. Who knows? Maybe he'll do it again. It's a whole lot of junk and then some. Stay tuned for more of the big guy, Super Chunk, on Cartoon Network. Ah! 